みなさんこんにちは本日の司会を務めます成城高校2年生長坂さらですどうぞよろしくお願いします Hello everyone I'm the chairperson for this judo exchange Sara Nagasaka from Seijo High School. Nice to meet you all. First, Hara's national anthem. <laughs> Seijou高校メディア部です。今回の成城デイリーは昨年12月に行われた成城高校の国際交流プログラムの様子をお伝えします。最初はパラオ柔道交流です。どうぞご覧ください。Yes, thank you and uh, good afternoon from Palau. Um, I would like to, on behalf of the Palau Judo Federation, thank you. And I uh, want to sincerely give our thanks also to our ambassador uh, to Palau from Japan. And really appreciate your continued support for Palau Judo, especially now in these very trying times. Uh, we hope that you stay healthy and Today's uh, training will help us uh, grow more as a member of the uh, Palau and Japan judo family. And once again, thank you and looking forward to what we're going to share further today. Thank you so much. Hello, For everyone in Palau, I'm very happy to be able to interact with you from over 3,000 kilometers away from here. I would like to tell you that all the staff of our school are very grateful to you. And also, I would like to express my respect for your interest and passion for the Japanese national sports of judo. Palau and Japan are both formed by many islands. I hope that this heartwarming exchange lasts and we can keep communicating together for years to come. I'd like to conclude my remarks by wishing you well, and I hope that our students will create strong, lasting friendship. I'm looking forward to today's judo exchange. Thank you. また、あの、大原会長、それから仕方校長におかれては本当にあの、お忙しいところをお伸びいただきましてありがとうございました。あの、本来ならばさっきあの、大原会長もおっしゃられてましたように、に本来皆様にこちらにおいていただきたいところは
which our school graduates received are displayed here. This is a photo of Ishikawa, a graduate who will participate in the Tokyo Olympic for volleyball. These are players who have participated in the, in the Olympic Games in the past. Our school is enthusiastic about studying and sports. Now, we will go into the gym. This gym is two stories. This gym is two stories high. And the judo show is on the first floor. This is the Kento Joe. Um, here is the Judo Joe. Parallel Judo Kids, today it's a short time, but we would like to introduce a part of our daily pr basic practice. As you know, it is very important to get a point with using various types of Nagewaza and Katamewaza. Nagewaza is throwing techniques, Katamewaza is grappling techniques. At first, we are showing you Nagewaza. The most important thing of Nagawaza is Kudushin, which means breaking opponent's balance. In order to Kudushi, you need to keep a correct distance between Uke position and Tachi position. If you don't get this correctly, you cannot break opponent's balance, and also it will flip them decisively. So you always need to check your standing position when you practice. Please watch them. はい、続けていきます。おびとり返し、本目。おびとり返し、ファーストおびとり返し。2本目。And はい、もう一回行きます。これを何回も繰り返して、その動きを習得します。皆さん、ありがとう覚えてますかスーラン、え、スーランです。スーラン。スーラン。ありがとう。はい。お願いします。お願いします。お願いします。お願いします。お願いします。お願いします。お願いします。お願いします。お願いします。お願いします。お願いします。お願いします。お願いします。お願いします。お願いします。お願いします。お願いします。お願いします。お
um, the candles that are lit for health and for the honor for the dead. Um, the Christmas holiday along with uh, the Easter holidays uh, are the biggest holidays uh, in the Christian calendar. Um, they mark respectively the birth of God's Son Jesus Christ and His sacrifice to atone for the sins of men and His resurrection. That's the is now. Hello. Uh, so, my name is Vasil or Bashiru, and I'm going to tell you something about Christmas in our country. So, in our everyday lives, however, Christmas is connected not only with the church canons, but with paganistic beliefs and rituals, as well as many modern events. We await Christmas impatiently every year. Nativity, or Christmas, is the brightest family holiday in Bulgaria. On that day, we try our best to gather our family together. It is preceded by 40 days of religious fasting, which end on the, 25th, on the 25th of December. The upcoming holidays are related with many rituals and beliefs. We are going to touch on a few of them, the ones which have retained themselves until now. Alexandra is now. Hi, I'm Alexandra and I'm going to tell you about the preparation on Christmas Eve. On the, same, on the 24th of December, which is Christmas Eve, all family members gather around the table. Uh, a not number of uh, meatless meals are prepared. They can be 7, 9 or 11. It is believed that the table should be cluttered in order to have affluence throughout the year. Dishes with legumes are prepared so that the following year can swell luck and fertility. Some of the most common meals uh, for that special night are uh, beans in a pot, stuffed peppers with rice, stuffed dried peppers with beans, cabbage, boat wheat, garlic, onion, walnuts and honey. Um, be sure to add salt. For, for Bulgarians, salt is very important. A house without salt is not good. And it is believed that uh, where the salt runs out, there are diseases and quarrels. Thank you. And now is Gergana. Hi. Um, we make bread with special decoration and the coin inside. It is an honor for every housewife to knead and decorate the bread. The lucky one who gets the piece with the coin will be rich and happy all year long. The decoration includes the cross, which is the main Christian symbol, and everything which is important for the family. For example, sun for health, chickens for children, a book for studying, horseshoe for work, uh, wheat for fertile fields and grapes for the vineyards. There are also beehives, pets, various family endeavors. Some families also have a special stamp blessing the bread. The tradition is to break the bread over the heads of the people in order to wish for the wheat to grow high next year. It is forbidden to leave the table during the festive meal. The table is cleaned on the next day because it is believed that at night the souls of the dead come to eat. Once upon a time, the table was arranged on the floor, on straw, and a large log was placed in the heart, the yew log. The fire is supposed to burn all night. And now Daria. Hello, I'm Daria. On December 25th, the Son of God, Jesus Christ, was born in Bethlehem. Jesus was conceived without blemish, born of a virgin, Mary, and came to earth to atone for all of mankind's sins. Thirty-three years later, he was crucified, and on the third day after his death, he was resurrected and ascended to heaven. On Christmas Day, we celebrate his birth. Then the star of Bethlehem appears... まだまだ続きますが、ここでおしまいです。バイバイ。